Hey everyone, in today's video I want to talk about a crazy bug that is going on with flashlights in the Cycle Frontier. As of patch 2.3.0, there is a bug that makes it so enemy players cannot see the flashlight from your gun when it's turned on. And given how dark it can be in certain areas of this game, right now some of those guns have a huge advantage. Now I've done some extensive testing and I wanted to make a quick video sharing everything with you that I found out. Because there's a lot of misconception about what is going on here. So I want to share everything with you, let you know where it's at. Um, also keep in mind that this is probably going to get patched in the future. I mean, surely it's a massive bug. Let's start with exactly what's happening. There are certain guns in the game that do not show light illumination to enemy players. And yes, it is gun specific. For example, when using a Phasic Lancer with your flashlight turned on, enemy players cannot see it. But when using the PDW, for example, with your light turned on, they can. The only guns that I have not tested are the K28, the Kinetic Arbiter, the Core 47, and the Basilisk. So let me know down in the comments below if you beat me to it on the testing for those specific guns, but I have everything else tested and here are the results. So the column on the left, the light is not visible to enemy players. And the column on the right, the light is visible. So you can see the list here. There's some pretty strong guns in here, especially like the Voltaic Brute, the Manticore, the Scrapper, some close range guns um, that you can keep that light on permanently and no one will ever see it right now. Now, before I end the video, I want to share with you uh, how I came to the conclusion and what steps I took to see um, if anything more unique was happening to cause the flashlights to not appear. First things first, teammate versus enemy player. So when you queue in with a teammate, the light can look different depending on which gun you're using. If it's an enemy player, that is the one that we are interested in. So if you are going to go do out your do your own testing, make sure that you are befriending a stranger in the world and you are going through and asking them if they can see the lights on the guns and or have them show you. It's important to know this when you're testing the guns um, that you are doing it right. Next, I did this testing with at least 10 different random players and every single one of them had the exact same results. There are specific guns that they cannot see the light on and there are specific guns that they can. I have tried it with variations of attachments on and or off the gun to see if like maybe a suppressor was causing the light to not work or something like that. I did a bunch of different tests there. All the same, it did not matter. Um, I also tried the same guns on different wall types, like the yellow standard wall or an in-cave wall or whatever. That didn't matter either. Didn't matter what the wall type was. We also checked uh, the difference between DirectX 12 and DirectX 11. Like if a player had DirectX 12 on, were they the ones that were unable to see the light? And we debunked that. That does not matter. We also tried, obviously because we had 10 different random players, they all had different graphics settings as well. So this is pretty wild and it's a pretty big bug. I definitely expect it to get nerfed, but you know, who knows how long that could take. I mean, there are still things in the game that are bugged that have been around since beta one. So you never know, um, but it is important to know which guns are producing actual light for the enemy player to see and which ones are not. Thank you so much for watching. As always, if you're looking to find your way back for more Cycle Frontier content, then make sure to drop a sub and I'll catch you in the next one.